question that a lot of people ask, are hey dudes good for walking? Well, I always say the answer will, it depends, okay? How far are you intending to walk in them? What's the weather going to be like when you're walking? And what is the terrain like? I think personally, hey dude shoes are great for walking short distances. So that's like doing errands, uh, dog walks around the neighborhood, or perhaps uh, walking around a shopping mall. Um, and if that's the, you know your normal walking, then that's fine. You've, they've got enough comfort in them that that you know, will do you okay, as long as you're not wearing them for hours and hours on end. They've got nice traction, as you can see, and that's gonna help to minimize any sore feet. However, if you're thinking of wearing them for big long walks or hiking long distances on some kind of uneven terrain or there's bad weather, then they are absolutely not the shoes to wear. Um, you need much better footwear and something much more robust and supportive if you're going to do that. If not, you're going to get problems. So I wear my Hey Dude short periods only, remember, and I would never consider wearing them for big, long walks or hiking. Now, what would be considered a good walking shoe? Well, I've put some links below to the type of walking shoes that you might want to think about um, using because those kind of walking shoes are the ones that you're going to need if you're uh, doing these longer treks. They're going to help to protect your feet and there's some good reasons why I'm recommending them rather than the Hey Dudes. So why would I not recommend Hey Dudes for walking? Everyone says, oh God, these are really comfortable. Well, there's a few reasons. One is they don't have great arch support, okay? Arch support helps to keep your feet in the correct position when you're walking, and that can uh, stop your feet from leaning to the side or coming out of your shoe and generally creating problems further down the line. Um, Yes, they've got a memory foam insole, but the arch support on it is pretty poor. So you really need some shoes that keep your feet more sturdy in a, in a good supported position. So that's the first thing. Um, there's no ankle support. So if you're hiking, um, you're going to need some of that in case you twist your ankle. So another important thing. Adjustable laces. Now, these do have laces, but as you can see, there's minimal amount of lacing and uh, there's not much there to keep your foot inside the shoe, especially when you're walking over, you know, uneven terrain. Uh, hiking shoes normally have laces that come right up and up towards the ankle. Um, and that's really important because you want to try and prevent your feet from getting hurt when you're doing those kind of walks. Another couple of problems why they don't make good hiking or long distance walking shoes is they have got traction. So this traction is great if you are uh, thinking about walking to the mall or just going on sidewalks. But if you're really going over slippery rocks on a, you know, a hilly mountainside, I can tell you now that you're going to slip in them. So you need some shoes that have got really good traction that are going to keep your feet uh, you know, firmly on the ground so you don't slip over. The other thing is that they aren't waterproof. Okay, so if it starts to pour with rain, your feet are going to get wet in these. They're water resistant, so they can deal with, you know, uh, a little bit of uh, rain, but anything more than that, and your feet are going to get sopping wet in them. So that's not going to make for a comfortable long distance walk. Finally, hey, do